dear students welcome to the problem solving sessions on the four year series at the interval 0,25 in this session we are going to see a simple problem but the problem which does not satisfies the property let us go into the problem before going into the problem those who don't watch the basics video under the interval 0,25 go to the playlist and watch the basics video as well as part 1 and part 2 video of problem solving sessions on 0,25 and then you can come back here then it will be more interesting for you to see this part 3 let us go into the problem my function is x square under the interval 0, 2 pi as i said we go systematically write the steps step one is my limits given f of x is equal to x square at the interval 0, 2 pi next obviously step two we are going to write the formula f of x a naught a n and b n once you write this now we have to think about step three step property we know the property but now there is a doubt see this function given in the question f of x equal to x square so it is easy you can guess the problem f of x equal to x square it does not involve any pi so i cannot apply the property because it will be neither f of x nor minus f of x when you replace x by 2 pi minus x so if you choose this kind of problem we have to solve a naught a n b n everything for the problem okay let us check this formally now x is replaced by 2 pi minus x so f of 2 pi minus x is 2 pi minus x whole square where my f of x is x square see this this is not equal to f of x as well as this is not equal to minus f of x this is a new function so i cannot apply the property i don't have choice now i have to do a naught a n b n one by one it is a little time consuming so if you have to make a choice if your other choices are good then you can do that problem because this problem we have to solve everything so let us do one by one also here since we are not able to use the property i am going to integrate always for the limit 0 to 2 pi now write the fourier series i am going to find the term a naught my a naught is going to be 1 by pi integral 0 to 2 pi and my function is f of x dx that is 1 by pi integral 0 to 2 pi x square dx integrating this we will be getting x cube by 3 integral 0 to 2 pi integrating this we will be getting x cube by 3 integral 0 to 2 pi applying the upper and lower limits we will be getting 2 pi whole cube by 3 for upper limit for lower limit it is 0 so my answer is 8 pi cube by 3 into this 1 by pi so my a naught is 8 pi square by 3 but i need a naught by 2 so always write a naught by 2 and highlight it a naught by 2 is 4 pi square by 3 we know that bernoulli integration formula is u is equal to u v minus u dash v1 plus u double dash v2 etc since my function is x square my answer for this integration will consist of three terms so let us do the integration i'll take u is equal to x square that is my diminishing function u dash is 2x u double dash is 2 u triple dash will become 0 here dv is equal to cos nx dx v is equal to sin nx by n and v1 is equal to minus cos nx n into n n square v2 is minus cos nx integration is sin nx by n cube now mapping this uv u dash v1 u double dash v2 and substituting in the bernoulli's formula we will be getting this now as i said whether the limit is 0, 2 pi or 0, pi or 0, l if it is going to be an integer then immediately the sign is going to be zero so now we have only the cosine term minus into minus plus i'll take this two outside and n square is also constant so i'll take this outside i'll be getting x into cos nx integral 0 to 2 pi so now when i put my lower limit x is 0 so answer is 0 so only upper limit survives 2 pi 
cos 2n pi now we know that cos odd number pi is minus 1 and cos even number pi is plus 1 so cos 2n pi is simply 1 so 2 by pi n square into 2 pi finally we will get the answer an is equal to 4 by n square you can see the typed version next we have to find bn similarly i will write 1 by pi integral 0 to 2 pi f of x sin n x that is 1 by pi integral 0 to 2 pi x square into sin n x now we have to use the same bernoulli's formula u is equal to x square u dash is equal to 2x u double dash is equal to 2 triple dash is 0 dv is equal to sin nx dx v is minus cos nx by n v1 is minus sin nx by n square and v2 is minus into minus plus cos nx by n cube now again we have to map uv u dash v1 u double dash v2 substitute in the bernoulli's formula now simplifying this will be getting 1 by pi my upper limit is 2n pi so i'll get my upper limit simplifying this terms will be getting 1 by pi my upper limit is 2 pi so i'll be getting 4 pi square and this negative term i'm writing here divided by n square plus 2 times cos n 2 pi divided by n cube this is my upper limit minus when i go for my lower limit when i put 0 here x square term is 0 so the whole term is 0 and for the second term i'll be getting 2 into cos n 0 divided by n cube now simplifying this now we know that cos 2n pi is 1 because it is going to be an even number so i can substitute 1 1 here i'll be getting this now i can cancel this both now my bn is 1 by pi minus 4 pi square by n here this pi pi will get cancel and my answer is the answer is minus 4 pi by n so i found my bn now substitute my a not an bn in the formula we get the final for your series so remember students if the given function f of x does not satisfies the property then no other go we have to solve like a not an bn and we have to substitute that to get the final answer for your series of f of x in the next video we are going to see problems under 0, 2l so the only difference is in 0, 2 pi or minus pi, pi my terms are simply cos nx sin nx etc under the limit 0, 2l or minus l, l we will be writing like cos n pi x by l and sin n pi x by l in the fourier series formula thank you for watching the video see you in the next video subscribe our channel share to your friends if you have any queries post in the comment box we will try to help you thank you